Okay, in this video, well, first of all, thank you for checking out my YouTube channel. And I hope you enjoy this video. And this is um, basically the initial setup or a first time setup of the Microsoft Lumia 950XL. So I already took the back cover off. And if you can see, it's a dual SIM card. So you could actually have two SIM card or two cell phone services running on this phone. And it has a micro SD card as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and enter the SIM card. And then it's already in there. I'm gonna put in the micro SD card. And if I had a second card, I would put it in here, but I don't, so. Oh, and this one, actually when you put in the battery, it's kind of weird, you have to actually put it in here because the camera is there and then you let it drop. And then you just put the phone cover on. And then just, oh, hold on. Just snap it all the way around. And it's all lined up. And then this is the power button here in the middle. You just press and hold it, and then it should power on. Unless the battery is completely dead, which it looks most likely like it is. This is a USB-C charger and if I remember, it doesn't matter how you plug it in. Okay, it just vibrated, so it should be getting power. I guess they ship these batteries completely dead. Normally the batteries have enough juice or enough power to at least give you a couple of minutes. So I guess I could pause the video and then just wait for the first screen to come up and I'll start the video again. Okay, so we're back now and the phone did turn off after a couple of minutes. And the first screen that you see is the welcome screen and you choose basically your language, which in our case is United States English. Next, United States. And that's legal stuff, yada yada yada. You could accept or reject if you don't want to use the phone. The date and time, we're in Pacific time in my case, so we hit next. Now here we're going to connect to Wi-Fi, so let me connect to one of the Wi-Fi locations. Okay, so I connected and just hit next after you connect to the Wi-Fi. You don't have to, it's up to you. And um, get going, just basically express, or you can customize the settings. I'll just choose express. Keep your life in sync. And basically you sign on with your Microsoft login. So let me hit and do that now.
So you just put your username and password for your Microsoft account, hit next. And I guess it depends on your connection now. And if you can see on the top, <clears throat> the number one SIM card has an antenna signal. There is no second SIM card, so it's blank. And since I'm connected to Wi-Fi, I have the Wi-Fi on the top. And then just to let you know when it was the battery was dead until the first screen. Okay, so here it tells me if I want to restore. I don't want to restore any previous. And then um, the OneDrive, this is the Microsoft Cloud. I just hit next. Cortana, you want to use Cortana because she's very helpful. And then it's going to start installing several apps. And if I remember from my previous Windows phones, which were Windows 8, this usually takes a while. So we could actually just cut the video off here and then come back when we get to the next screen. Okay, so now we're back. And um, this is the first screen you get after all the apps are installed. If your apps have finished installing, you just hit next says you're all done and have fun so you hit done and this is the Windows 10 screen so it says that it detected a new SD card do you want to store photos and go to storage settings I'm gonna say no and then actually go to the SD card and wipe it out which actually I forgot how to do that I've never used Windows 10 so okay so I was looking to format the SD card and this message came up it's basically about the SIM card I guess there's changes or whatever so it's like a restart is required Kind of like in the PCs, so I'm just going to go ahead and restart because I don't want any problems during the setup. So you may get something very identical depending on the service that you're using. In my case, I'm using Cricut Wireless. So that is the message I get when I get when I first do the initial setup through Cricut Wireless. And this is kind of nice so you actually see how long it takes to do an actual, I guess, reboot or restart of the cell phone. So you get an idea of how long it takes to do that. And one thing that is very nice about this phone and the reason I bought it, um, so I could take better videos for YouTube, it shoots actually an Ultra HD 4K video. And the uh, pictures are very nice as well. It's a 20 megapixel camera. Okay, so now we're back. So I'll go ahead and pause the video again because I got to figure out how to format the SD card. Okay, so I figured out how to format the SD card from the main menu. That is the settings icon. You go to settings and then you go to system, storage, you go to the SD card, so I have stuff on it from something else, just go down to the bottom and then there's a format key. It says format, are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. And it'll format the SD card and get it ready. So then now it says they found a new card, as the previous message said. And in this case, I'm going to say yes. I want everything saved to the SD card. So now if you look at the options, the SD card is completely empty almost. A couple of kilobytes, I think, from the formatting. And then the new apps will get installed on the SD card, downloads, SD card, music, SD card, pictures, and video as well. So 
aside from that the setup is completely done and one thing that's pretty cool if you notice there's two call buttons in case you had two different cell phone services number one number two there's nothing in number two of course but if you did you could actually choose which cell phone service to use messages as well have two different um, icon services and I'm not too sure how the internet works as far as the connections go I'd have to research that more but I'll probably do a review of the 950 and add a lot of I guess tips or tricks I guess people would like to see and um, thank you for watching my video I hope you enjoy it and I hope you if you do happen to have one of these phones you set it up and you're ready to go thank you very much